Alrighty guys, what's going on? Linky here and welcome back to another episode of the Theta SMP server. Today, I've done a bit off camera that I want to show to you guys. I'll explain what's going on with my inventory in just a moment. But firstly, I figured I would come up here to the top of this mountain, look overlooking my base. Uh, Sansu's base is over there. Someone else is building a base on the other side of the mountain. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. And I just wanted to give you guys a quick overview of the base right now. So as you can see, you've got the main building there. And then to the right, I built a little bit of a bridge, which I'll go down and show you guys. It's not done yet. We're going to be working on that in today's episode. Then over there, we have the three farms. So you got the carrots, the potatoes, and the wheat. That looks like I'm missing a carrot on the um, left one. So I'll probably go and fix that. Then you got the nether portal. We got all the things, all the sugar canes. I built a little pathway with lily pads from this island to this island because it needed to happen. Like, it was irritating me. I'm not sure how I feel about the lily pads yet. I did it in kind of like a design that, like, some of the lily pads are missing. I might remove a couple of them, like, maybe remove that one or something like that. And then I put the bridge on this side because I figured we may as well have both. So let's just head down there and check out everything that I've been doing. Firstly, there is a zombie here that we're just going to quickly get rid of. So you can... So, um, just, oh, these are the people I right now, by the way. Destroyed is a new member, so, by the way, welcome him to the server, but, um, he just got killed by a wither. Let's just jump down into here, into the water, and let's take a look at all the stuff that I've been doing at my base. So, we end up over here. The first thing is the bridge, which is incomplete. I'm gonna be putting fences along the bottom of the bridge, probably, and then from there, we can figure out what we want to do with, like, the different, like, stone designs of it. Right now, it is a very basic bridge. We killed that creeper right when it was needed. Got you. There should be another creeper over here. Oh my goodness gracious, back away. Do we have arrows? No, we do not. We didn't get them. I want to get rid of the creepers before anything. They're an awful... Oh, there's a witch as well. Like, look at all these animals. All right, animals, mobs. Okay, I'm getting attacked by three different skeletons right now. Got you. Okay, you're just really getting on my nerves now at this point. Hello, witch. You're getting... Very irritating. There's a creeper here. Got ya. Alright. Are we, like, free from the mobs now? I hope we are. Let me just eat. There are a lot more mobs in this forest than I thought there would be. Let's just try to... Let's try to get out of here for the time being. But anyway, this is some of the stuff that I've been working on. Hang on, let me just collect all that. Are we gonna... We've been... We've got ten more seconds of poison. Let's get into our house. Just in case we do end up, like, dying of witch poison. Can you die from... No, you can't. Wait. No, you can't die from witches. Alright, good. So couple things that I've done in my base. I've been working on the food supply. So here, this is all the food we've got going right now. Not too much. I've got, I went and bought out Pyrus's shop. So we've got a ton of steak now. I'm actually going to grab probably like 28 of that for the time being. But I bought out Pyrus's shop. We have some cooked pork chops that I'm working on. And that is coming from the pig farm that I set up. And that's basically, we've just, essentially this week has just been me trying to be as self-efficient as possible on the server. So this is the pig farm. This is Debbie. If, you, if you're a new viewer to Theta, this is my noble steed. This is Debbie. Debbie used to have um, this iron horse armor, but I got some diamond horse armor to put on her. So that's nice. So that's basically everything that we've been working on here. I think, I hope you guys like it. It's really nice right now. The pigs, I've been breeding and then killing. Just trying to get a good population of them going right now. Because once I have a decent sized um, population, I'm going to be going down to the enchanting room in the nether. And I'm going to be trying to get a flame sword and a looting sword. So if you put flame and you put looting on your sword, I believe the looting works for animals. So if you kill them, you have a chance of getting more drops than you usually will. And the flame will also cook the pork. So I don't even need to cook it because once I kill them with the flame sword, the pork will already be cooked from killing them, which is really good. So double the pork already cooked. It's going to be a really nice farm once it's all done. Uh, I'm looking to expand into a watermelon farm and a pumpkin farm by the next episode. Those are my goals right now. Uh, I'm thinking pumpkin farm and pumpkin farm because I want to start making pumpkin pie. That's one thing that I haven't done like in a while on any servers that I've been playing on. On Purge, I don't even believe we ever crafted pumpkin pie. So doing that on this server is going to be a really strange priority. What's this? CM Brockman shop recording soon. I believe this is going to be CM's build shop. Unless, oh wait, actually, I think maybe CM and DJ are doing that somewhere else. So we'll have to go and check. But there's a bunch of new shops that spawn that I figured we'd show off. This one does not have a name yet, but apparently it is... Oh, it's a bakery. No pumpkin pie yet. Bread. This one diamond for each. Two diamonds for a stack of bread. So it looks like it's a nice little bakery you can pay here. 
I'm looking for him to get pumpkin pie. I think that'll be a cool food to have. And then on the other side, there's Gapple's wood shop. So in here he sells all of the different types of wood and leaves and different items that you can get from the trees. So that's actually really cool. This is a nice, he's got some payments in here. Gapple, you should go check those before I take them. But other than that, nothing else on this street except CM's shop up there. Let's take to the next street. That's the nether portal. I thought we were moving that, but apparently we're not. Uh, down here, I believe it's the only, it's the same two shops that have been here the entire time. So that's Voss's horse shop. Which, does he have horses yet? No, he does not. And Pyrus's food shop. There's also this being built, which I'm not sure. That's a plicity. This is Will's building. This actually looks kind of... I'm excited for this one. I love the um the stone design with the flooring and the different, like, mossy stones on the walls. I think that looks really cool. So that's actually all the stuff on this road. I went ahead and expand... I dug out some grass uh, yesterday. And I expanded this road a bit. I'm going to fill it in with gravel and cobblestone probably later tonight. And that'll be really nice. Hopefully we can get that done. This is CM and DJ's plot. This could be where they're building the build shop. I don't know. The build shop is going to be really cool. I'll probably pay them to like remodel my house once it's open. Because I am not the best builder as you guys will probably all know if you're longtime viewers of any survival series on my channel. I'm terrible when it comes to building. So I'm definitely going to look to get them to work on something for me. But there are a ton of new buildings on this side of the road. So let's start with the first one on the right. Which is H Monkey's flower stand. So in here... You can buy roses, peonies, this is the payments chest, lilacs, and sunflowers. I might get some sunflowers once I get some money, but that's actually a really cool design. I remember, where do I remember this design from? Oh, yes. On season one of the Cube SMP, someone, I believe it was Devin, did a uh, fireworks stand with a similar design to this. And I always loved that shop, so I'm really glad we have one of those on the server now. Over here, the shop has been here from the beginning. This is... Toby's Enchanted Bookshop. Next up, we have Rise Steak Store, the left hook. So you've got steak and a payments chest. Very simple, not much to it. But uh, Rye, as I will tell you as well, you're currently out of steak. So you should probably go and get that stocked up sometime soon. Next up next to this, next up next to his steak shop is Trident's Rock Store. All right, let's see. So payments. Diorite, two stacks for a diamond, two stacks for a diamond for stone. It's all two stacks, granite and andesite. You know what you should do, Trident? You should sell the, um, these kind of blocks, and then you should also sell the polished versions and possibly, like, the, um, stone brick of stone here. I think that'd be really cool. you could probably drive up prices with that. And then this thing, which Fluffy needs to work on. This is Fluffy's fish market. Is it open? Hang on. Cooked salmon is out. Fluffy, you're out of your shop. I don't know. Is this the design? I always thought... I always thought he, like, didn't put a roof on it or anything. But apparently, this is his entire shop. Alright. I mean, I'm not gonna question it all that much. But I will go with it. Alright, Fluffy. That's a decent shop. But anyway, we're back. We kind of dropped in frames for a second there. But I do apologize for that. Next up, we go over here. The bridge, as always. And then there's Isle of Tempest. Toby, you gotta do something with this building, man. There's absolutely nothing here. And it's concerning. Because I might want to build here. Because this is a really nice plot of land. Toby, if you're watching this video, I want to buy this plot of land off you. So leave a comment. Hit me up on Skype. I want this plot of land. Because I think this could be really cool. It's nice and terraformed already. Surrounded by water, so we can do some cool stuff with it. It's right next to spawn, so it's it's prime real estate for anything that we want to get done. And I think it'd be really cool. So, if Toby... Also, they've expanded the road. Since the previous episode, this road has not been this far. And they built it out going this way as well, so it can go all the way down that way. And then if you also take the stairs up here, it leads up onto the top of this hill. So, a lot of space to build shops. This is Gapple's plot. Pyrus set up a plot here. There are no plots on this side of the street yet. But I'm assuming that's because there's a mountain here and it doesn't leave too much room to build something. Unless we're... I don't know if we have clearance to kind of clear up this mountain, open up some more space for a shop. I'll have to talk to Gapple about that. We'll see what he says on that matter. But yeah, if he actually... If we can maybe open up some more land over here, I think what we could do is we could potentially bust it right here. Bust out the stone here. We could build our shop here. I think that'd be cool if we kind of like back up the land a bit. I believe this was terraformed. I don't think this hill was here before. So if we kind of move it back, mess with it a bit, I don't think anybody will really mind. Also, there used to be a lot more trees here. It's becoming a lot more barren around spawn, which is really exciting. But I'm going to put these slabs back. Oop. Put these slabs back just so, just so I don't make too much of a mess of it. What we might do is, once I can collect this, maybe we'll go ahead and we'll claim a plot 
for ourselves right now. I think that could be cool. So what we'll do is we'll head to a nice piece of real estate. We'll claim it for ourselves, and that should be it for today. Just a little update video showing you guys off everything that's happened on the server. Now, the question... I forgot we had a sign in the inventory. The question of the day is where do we want to set up this plot? Where do we want to put it that a lot of people are going to go to? And I'm thinking... Let me see. I'm thinking over here. I mean, this is the area of spawn that people really aren't touching right now. So, sticking a shop here could be a really good idea. And since there is no sign here, this, I think, is going to be my plot right here. So, let's go. Linky's plot. I can't type. Where's the P? There's the P. Linky's plot. There we go. So, this is where we're going to be building our shop. I'm going to make a little marker here. I'll put a chest next to it so people can know this is my base and guys i think that's where we're going to end off today's episode so if you all enjoyed today's episode of the theta smp please be sure to drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel if you are not subscribed already leave a comment because it's great to see all the feedback in the comment section it's really cool to know that you guys are around to leave the comments and all that good stuff and yeah hope you all enjoyed as always i've been linky we'll see y'all in the next video